Tonight, there is trouble in Hood. A controversy has ignited in the small delta town along the Sacramento River between its fire department and a local restaurant. And tonight, we're getting answers on what's behind the debate. The town of Hood is the kind of place where just about all the 300 or so people who live there know each other. I love this place. But there's a controversy brewing at the town's bar and grill, which is decorated with fire-themed memorabilia. It's named Hood Station Firehouse 92, and this new sign outside just went up this week. Now that name is igniting a controversy. There's always issues within a small town. That it turns out that Station 92 is also the name of the town's volunteer fire station, which serves Hood and Cortland. A message was posted on its official Facebook page calling out the restaurant for copying the name, saying, quote, its arrogant owner has decided to use our name to gain credibility in the community. It goes on to say he has no permission to use our fine fire department name or number in association with his business. The restaurant owner did not want to comment on camera about the post, but tells CBS 13 he chose the name to honor and show respect for the firefighters, and he himself was once a volunteer for the department. The ownership has been really good. It's been an asset to our little community. Town Council Chairman Mario Morena says he's surprised by the controversy. I'm hopeful that everything can get resolved in a very good way. Customers we spoke with don't seem to be confused by the similar names. I think it uh, sounds like a good thing to me. I don't know why there would be a controversy about it. We reached out to the fire district for further comment, but there was no one at the station and phone calls were not returned. The Facebook post has now been taken down. A burning debate over a fire station name. Now many here hope this dispute will be resolved. We'll have to take a look and see how we can make this work for both entities. Well, the fire department is asking community members to sign a petition to get the name changed, and the restaurant owner says he's contacted an attorney to try and end the dispute.